Um, the reason why I decided to come to Project Veritas is because um, people need to know what's actually going on with Google. There's this facade about what they're doing, but what they're actually doing, what the employees are actually seeing inside the company is different. But the reason we launched our AI principles is because people were not putting that line in the sun. They were not saying what is fair and what's equal. So we're like, well, we are a big company. We're going to say it. The people who voted for the current president do not agree with our definition of fairness. They're not objective piece. They're not an objective source of information. But then there are teams uh, which are called ML Fairness. ML Fairness, the teams? Fairness, like, yeah. you know, you need to be fair. If we're also training our algorithms, like if 2016 happened again, would we have, would the outcome would be different? They are a highly biased political machine um, that is bent on never letting somebody like Donald Trump come to power again. But 2020 is certainly on top of now my own. Organization Trust and Safety is top of mind. They've been working on it since 2016 to make sure we're ready for 2020. This is a Goliath I'm but of David trying to say that the Emperor has no clothes. He got called in front of Congress multiple times. They can pressure us, but we're not changing. Being a small little ant, I can be crushed and I'm aware of that. But this is something that is bigger than me. This is something that needs to be said to the American public. What? Elizabeth Warren is saying that yeah. we should break up Google. She's I'm like, I love her, but she is very misguided. Like, that will not make it better, it'll make it worse. Because now all these smaller companies who don't have the same resources that we do will be charged with preventing the next Trump situation. It's like a small company cannot. And it's like...